well, we tried the meatball sandwich from Mom. Um, uh, get up, uh, get up. <laughs> and that was very good. It was nice and juicy. I like the sauce. The sauce and, uh, really good. And the spices were really nice. We've been friends since we're 14. <laughs> I'm a technology project manager, so I've been in corporate America for over 20 years. I used to bring the meatballs to our project team meetings and everybody loved them and it just sort of evolved from that. I said my dream job wouldn't have a, a phone or a computer, so we, we landed on the food truck. We have a vegetarian meatball, we do barbecue meatball, we do sliders. We'd like to make your meatball sandwich the way you'd like hot peppers, green peppers, a lot of sauce, not a lot of sauce. And our concept's just that there's more than one way to get a meatball. Oh, the meatballs were soft, warm, the meat was delicious, and the sauce was like creamy and thick, really good. I think they're shocked and then they come back like, you know, days like that was really that was really good meatball if they try the vegetarian they do the same thing are you sure that was vegetarian not meat so I think it's a good product and people always they hunt us down they'll drive for us get a pepito was a wonderful sandwich it was just wonderful the bread was crispy enough the meatball spicy enough I think they're cute on you know on some level and I think you have people that say I love being a food truck I don't know if you hear people say I love being a restaurant as much as you hear them say, I love being a food truck, it's like we're this whole thing. It's we're a community, it is. Yeah, definitely. There's a lot of freedom to it, and I like being outside, I like cooking for my friends, and I love when people like our meatballs, and like Jen said, people will drive and stop their car and be like, you know, can we get a meatball sandwich? So that's what it's happy. Yeah, that's and what it's all for. It. I think we will grow if they loosen the parking restrictions from being 200 feet from a restaurant, that is really it because there's just simply not enough parking for trucks. Um, and unless that loosens up, uh, I think it's gonna be challenging for it to grow.